My feminism will whoop your misogyny's ass any day of the week. Cause my feminism ain't no punk. My feminism knows that you fight like a girl is not an insult, won't settle for all the stereotypes because girls are not fragile. We are strong-minded, built to last. My feminism is a lit match, a broken fuse, a furious flame burning bras, panties, and all ties to bad relationships. Why is that to cost so much for good support? For $45, I'd much rather keep my money and hold myself up. My feminism says equal work deserves equal pay. Duh, your dick doesn't make you any more or less equipped than me. See, I like to think I come from a dying breed, one who will just lay down and take it. Unlike the old adage, I'm good for more than just laying on my back. Sometimes I like being on top. My feminism will twerk, shake, and drop everything she got to the floor with no hands. Say, sometimes when I move, my ass moves the opposite direction. But we are not asking for attention. Do not need any of your permission. My feminism is not for all your slut shaming and your name calling, your body politics. This vagina has a mouth and she will speak for herself. My feminism does not like boxes or closets or hiding spaces. It's not about exclusionary tactics. Not afraid to be bold, to stand out, to live proud. My feminism talks like this because I can back it up. See, I don't speak on facts of what a woman should do because I respect the woman's right to choose. I don't like carry legs or armpits, but I won't knock you if you do. And I would never kill a gestating child of mine, but I respect your right to choose. My feminism does not promote violence as I'm being provoked. I don't incite a riot unless I see a threat of smoke, and I don't take too kindly as idle threats. I speak. Even when I'm not spoken to, I move, and I don't wait for your instructions. My feminism says, fuck all your rules. But my feminism knows how dangerous it is to be female, to be born woman, to know the heaven and the hell I hold in this body, this temple, yet I keep praying for the day I won't be forced to divorce myself from this skin, to undo this back-breaking labor called life, pick a lesser of two evils, a more subtle form of oppression. My feminism knows I don't just live in theory, in debate, in dissertation, in your textbook, I am a daily contradiction, a walking counter-argument, and my feminism teaches me to never, ever be silent.